I'm CJ with Starter Builds, and today I'm going to show you how to build this really cool DIY rustic centerpiece on Starter Builds. Back to what I was saying. <laughs> What's up, CJ here with Starter Builds, and in today's video, I'm gonna show you how to build a really cool rustic centerpiece for your table. Uh, this is a very DIY friendly project, fairly easy to make, and it's one of those things that I had a lot of scrap wood laying around, so I figured why not take the time to show you guys how I'm gonna go ahead and build this centerpiece for my DIY round dining room table, which I'll have a link down in the description to that video as well if you wanna check that out. As far as materials go for this specific project, you're not gonna to need too many things. I'm actually using some one by four pallet boards. Now you could go ahead and buy these from your big box store, but these are just pallet boards that I had in my scrap pile. I have some flat bar here. This is a uh, an eighth inch thick, uh, three foot flat bar that I got from, I believe a big box store as well. And then I have another flat, um, another pallet board here too as well now again you could go to the store and buy one by four boards but you can also just get a pallet and disassemble it as well and then i also have these little fake or fox succulent plants which is actually what is going to be going in the centerpiece so you can get these from any local big box store walmart target uh craft stores sell them too as well so i just had them kind of sitting in my house and i figured let's actually build something that is diy friendly to hold those for a centerpiece so Stay tuned for the rest of the build, guys.
All right, here we have the final DIY rustic centerpiece. Want to give a quick overview of what this looks like. It's very DIY friendly. If I actually zoom out here, you can see the DIY round dining room table. I'll have links down in the description below to that video as well if you want to check that out. As always guys, thanks so much for watching. If you liked this video, give it a thumbs up. And if you feel like I deserved it, hit that subscribe button because I'd love to have you be a part of the Starter Builds family.